Hey guys, so the market hit 82 today. We're above the 8,100 breakout point. What should you do to buy? What should you do to sell? Or should you just maximize your trades? The goal of this video is just temper you so that you don't base your trades on emotion. You don't sell too early and then you, you don't buy at a very, very high price. What should you do right now when the market is bullish? It's continuing its reversal and it just broke out. Check this video out. Hey guys, good morning from Qatar. It's my third day here and it's been an amazing uh, few days so far talking about stocks to our Kababayans here and let me give you an update on the market. So you've all noticed that over the past few days I've mentioned that uh, the market has turned bullish. From a position trading standpoint, the charts are confirming that the stock and the market in general is now from, from a stock from a market that used to be bearish from something that was headed down it's now starting to shift and it's now starting to uh, continue its progression upward so as you all know if your goal and your narrative is you're a position trader the way to win is just to follow and stay with the trend as we all know the stock the market is currently in an uptrend the market is still pushing and making its way up so if you are a position trader continue to just stay into your positions continue to just hold and maximize it and uh, hold up until we see a certain reversal uh, a few days ago I've mentioned also that stocks or the market in general also uh, works and moves in ranges and I mentioned that uh, the certain range or the next resistance is around 8100 and over the past few days we've started to somehow no have some hesitation every time the market goes to 81 it would break out a bit hover then drop down break out a bit hover and drop down today though we we are as of this time now it's at 223 so we still have an hour uh, left before the market i uh, would uh, would somehow close we are at 8200 already which gives us significant upside already from the breakout of 8100 so why am i saying this why is this significant majority of the parameters that we are looking at right now for the markets are mostly still bullish meaning if you are following where it's possibly headed it's still pointing that the market will still go up but it's just that what changed is we broke out of the 8100 resistance now if 8100 continues to solidify this will now become our new support level i repeat if we stay above 81 81 now will solidify itself as a new support level and the next possible area for the market to go will be 8500 so you can watch this and you can pack this over the next few days if we stay above 81 the markets now have a shot to go to 8500 it's all hinged and it's all dependent on it staying above the 8100 level so interesting days especially for those who positioned early interesting days especially for those who uh, entered when the market was starting to reverse or who, for those who, bought, who bought at certain support levels but I'll make another update later uh, most likely when the markets are closed and I'll add a couple of stocks to it as well so I guess that's it for now uh, please remember at this point in time uh, what will kill you is your emotions that you are trying to I don't know uh, anticipate and forecast where the market will go but if there's one thing that I know in 12 years of trading and investing it's not about you trying to forecast where the market is headed in, but for you to win it's about you just following and maximizing the trend and two things we know now we're still in an uptrend number two we broke out from 81 if 81 holds the next target price will be 8500 so that's it for now I hope this video helps you trade well trade strong trade smart Marvin Germo from Qatar see you all tonight